God, who is rich in mercy and love, gives us a new birth into a living hope through the sacrament of baptism. By water and the word, God delivers us from sin and death and raises us to new life in Jesus Christ. We are united with all the baptized in the one body of Christ, anointed with the gift of the Holy Spirit, and joined in God's mission for the life of the world. Who presents Madeline for baptism? <laughs> Doug and Angie, as you bring Madeline, your daughter, to receive the gift of baptism, you are entrusted with responsibilities to live with her among God's faithful people, to bring her to the Word of God and the Holy Supper, teach her the Lord's Prayer, the Creed, and the Ten Commandments, place in her hands the Holy Scriptures, and nurture her in faith and prayer, so that she may learn to trust God Proclaim Christ through word and deed. Care for others and the world God made. Work for justice and peace. May you promise to help Madeline grow in the Christian faith and life. If so, say, we do. We do. And to the Godmothers gathered here, do you promise to nurture Madeline in the Christian faith as you are empowered by God's Spirit and to help her live in the covenant of baptism? Union with the church, if so say, I do. And all of you who gather at the river, people of God, do you promise to support Madeline and pray for her and her new life of faith in Christ? We do. And now I ask you, as we have heard that the church has done throughout the ages, we join all the saints to profess our faith in Christ Jesus, reject sin and confess the faith of the church. And I would ask you to kind of face it out there. I know that's not exactly west, but let's just face it that way. And let us do as the church has done throughout the ages and hold our hands up in defiance of all the pharaohs of the world. And I ask you, do you renounce the devil and all the forces that defy God? I renounce them. Do you renounce the powers of this world that rebel against God? I renounce them. You renounce the ways of sin that draw you from God. I renounce them. And now I would ask you to lower your hands as you rest assured that God is with us. Do you believe in God the Father? I believe in God the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. Do you believe in God, the Holy Spirit? I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life of God's Amen. The Lord be with you. And, and also with you. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give our thanks and praise. We give you thanks, O God, for in the beginning your spirit moved over the waters. And by your word you created the world, calling forth life in which you took the life. Through the waters of the flood you delivered Noah and his family. And through the sea you led your people Israel from slavery and freedom. At the river your son was baptized by John and anointed with the Holy Spirit. By the baptism of Jesus' death and resurrection, you set us free from the power of sin and death and raise us to live in you. I would ask the young people who are gathered here to come forward as we pray for the Holy Spirit to stir up the waters. And there's some young ones there who are going to help us stir up. You can come up here and help us stir up these waters and get them ready with God for Madeline's baptism. We're going to stir these waters. Pour out your Holy Spirit, the power of your living word, those who are washed in the waters of baptism may be
given new life. To you be given honor and praise through Jesus Christ our Lord. And the unity of the Holy Spirit now and forever. Amen. Amen. And young people stand back now just a little bit from the baptism of the <laughs> <laughs>
welcome Angie and Doug, and we celebrate Madeline's baptism this day. We